Um, I was in Colorado and I started getting sick of uh, traveling because the payroll was just messing up my pay all the time and I couldn't find contracts where I wanted to and I had recruiters just pushing me all over the country and I was just not feeling that. Right. Normally I'm like the type of guy to just a wing it. I've been trying to get my notes in line to update you guys on where I am today because just my channel is definitely backed up obviously because uh, I was depressed for almost a year because I've lost Lexi but we're gonna get into that so hold on one second are you ready to go to the park <laughs> So I'm gonna update you guys from the most recent video that is out on the tube prior to this video because I'm cutting into uh, uh, my storyline basically. All my videos I try to keep in line throughout the process of where I traveled or where I'm working etc. I really don't tell you guys exactly where I'm working um, unless it's on Instagram. So if you guys are not following me, Instagram at far from homeless. It's far from home underscore l-e-s-s -S. the channel here most recent video was with stephanie where i went and did manitou incline and he goes watch that video guys i actually um done left california and drove cross country and made a couple videos along the way and when i got back to massachusetts i didn't hang out long because i had a contract in Fredericksburg, Virginia, pretty much waiting for me to go ahead and get down there and start. Now I did that contract, it started getting cold, Lexi was enjoying the snow, etc. but uh, she ended up having some sort of cough. You okay? You okay? You okay? <sighs> it's okay, baby. And I wasn't really thinking it was something to do with her, her chest. But anyways, fast forward, um, a couple weeks went by and it was just continuous cough. And I, I was like, yeah, I gotta bring her to the vet back home. And we went to her original vet where I brought all the puppies when mama, AKA lady had 13 of them. I brought her to the vet and they didn't chest x-ray. And basically they told me her heart and was enlarged and her uh, heart was pressing up on her lungs and that was making a uh, fluid build up in her lungs and that's why she was trying to cough it up all the time the night before christmas eve she was having no problems like she was happy to eat with us and stuff like that but then that night she really started coughing up I know, boo boo. I know. That next day on Christmas, I had to put her down. And it still hits me. Um, but after that, you know, I, uh, I went back to Fredericksburg. I went back to work on the 26th, which, which was friggin' stupid. Or I think it was the 27th, but I, I think I know I rushed back down. And uh, I. I tried to finish the contract three weeks went by and I just done walked out I couldn't do it no more so I went back home and I done had a water leakage in my garage coming from my tank my water tank and I had to restore the, the garage areas that I might go ahead and get rid of from what I know it's a hot water tank like a hot water heater it's my first time draining it I'm taking it because I got water here and I've been working on the back drying it up and cleaning and drying it up and yeah just want to spend some time again before everything's gone it's in the air can't you feel it there you guys time to finish this I added a heating pad to the passenger side of the water tank this is actually going to be flapped over but there's going to be a hole cut that way this can sit flush on there along with this hole right here sorry this hole and this hole
so I did that for a couple of weeks and then I picked up a contract uh, in Bridgeport, Connecticut. I finished that contract, no problem. And I went out to Colorado and my friend Stephanie came to visit and we did a bunch of different videos and exploring. It was a great time, but I just couldn't be there for the winter. Not that I don't have heat in my transit. It's just that I didn't want to deal with the snow and I wanted to get back to California and I did three months there. I just finished that contract up. Another video, another GoPro, and another facility done. And I'm gonna be heading to the Grand Canyon and I went to Rancho Mirage, but now I'm in San Diego. And the reason I'm in San Diego, I'll tell you in a few minutes, but I took a contract at Eisenhower uh, next to Palm Springs in the desert when the guy's like oh you want to come to the desert I was like yeah 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 but I didn't really really think about it until I got there and I'm like dude it really is the desert sand everywhere and I was just not feeling it It was stupidly hot um, I didn't do any videos in, out there because just really nothing out there I did meet up with a, a buddy off of Instagram you were driving out bro What's up? how are you how are you Mike but we got some Bridges right here where the water river used to flow. I made a lot of videos there. So like I got video content still from Colorado and exploring here in Southern California. So I will be pushing that content out and you know making more content down here in San Diego. I applied to a manager position out in San Diego and I didn't hear anything about it. So I took on the contract in Rancho, came out to Rancho and I just realized like, dude, it's not what I want out here. You know, I'm nowhere near the ocean. I can't go scuba diving. And that's what I just did two days ago. On Saturday, I went scuba diving. Today is Veterans Day. And I'm just chilling at this park literally like i could see a amusement park right behind me and just where i'm at right now everybody is living that van life and this is what we're doing is just chilling um i see a couple people over there with a couple short buses and they're restoring those and converting them and whatever but uh yeah i figured i'd let you guys know i took on a full-time job in san diego and i am now a clinical coordinator i will be training staff and this is a big step, but I figured I'd let you guys know uh, I'm doing well. The certifications that I've been trying to uh, accomplish, I now have CRCST, which is Certified Registered Central Sterile Technologist. I've been that for 16 years. Uh, I just recently got the CHL, which is Certified Healthcare Leader, and I just got CIS about three weeks ago as a certified instrument specialist so I am certified you guys and I'm moving on to bigger things and I don't know how long I'll be out here in California but uh, I'm definitely gonna take this job serious because this is something I've been working towards ever since I left Beth Israel in Massachusetts so I'm gonna edit this video you guys stay tuned I got another video um, from just two days ago where I was actually in Laguna Beach doing a shore dive got Malcolm over there stay tuned for that like this video comment subscribe uh, let me know if you've ever been to San Diego because <laughs> last time I was here was with Lexi we were at Ocean Beach Dog Beach and I have a video on that and you guys God rest her soul because I do miss that little girl be easy guys, peace. California, then you'll be mine.